Welcome back heroes to some more Pokemon Empyrean. Last episode we got the second gym badge. Silent the gym leader did not want to be a gym captain no more. So luckily uh, me and the gym, so the ranger came up to his dad and was like, yo, you gotta stop being the worst person in the world and let your son do what he wants to do. And the dad gave in and now Sila is going to become a ranger and he's heading to um, Route 102, going to the highway and we are in uh, Duruma City right now and we're going to get the third gym badge. And to do that we have to enter the tournament and win the tournament, then we can enter uh, we'll battle the gym captain. So, let's go and do this. Oh, it's uh, quite busy in here. Can we battle any trainers? Hi, I'm the Pokemon Move Maniac. I know every single move that Pokemon learned growing up. That's pretty cool. Uh, hi. So the Stein Radio Wavelet machines cannot heal your Pokemon inside buildings such as this one. We're working on it. Oh, okay, cool. They say Ashy uses fire and dark type Pokemon. Should be no match for my Primarina. Oh, wow. Yeah, definitely. Primarina's going to smash it. You have to win against all three trainers in the tournament. And if you don't, Ashy won't appear. But uh, she might not appear anyway. I heard she's still doing her her show at the circus. Ah, she's so pretty. I think I'm in love. But she'd probably kick my butt and scream at me I'm a weakling or something. That's the best. That's what you want, man. That's what you want. So the operators are all hotties, aren't they? <laughs> I'm not here for them. I'm waiting for Ashley to come and uh, grace us with her divine presence. Hi. Heard some people overleveled their pokies and could not enter the tournament because of it. Oh no. Also heard there's a simply... As a simple remedy, a Pokazar guy in town is selling reverse candies. Yeah, so I think we might be okay, because the soft level cap's 32, so I'm assuming anything 33 and above might be too high. So we'll see. Uh, hi. That's the PC. Oh, okay. Uh, Battle Grid Co. runs this arena, and that's why the name is splashed, uh, splash, splashed is all over the place. Apparently Miss Ashy, the gym captain, stand at the top of this tournament. It's related to the owner of Battle Grid. Are you entering the tournament? Ashy will burn you to the ground or whip you out of the arena. Pinky swear. <laughs> I want to be just like her when I grow up. Yeah, something went wrong in the system. Well, the good lady's checking it for me. Alright. Buzz off, kid. Sorry. <laughs> We're here live, reporting from the Doo River City's Grand Tournament Arena, where the Doo River Circus Ringmaster and Gym Captain Ashy will make an appearance. Do I, talk, do I speak to you? They say Ashy. Oh, no, yeah, I did. Uh, hi. So, hi, are there any uh, open tournaments? We're well, sorry, there aren't any open tournaments at the moment. Oh, what? No. Unless I gotta enter one of these. Oh, read about. Sorry. Normal. So, normal or normal NMK tournament features end trainer fights in a row, each using exactly M Pokemon. You'll be able to enter at most M Pokemon. Your Pokemon's level must be K at most. You can lose or win, but you always stay in the tournament until the end. As with Elimination Tournament, there's a no heal variant where your Pokemon are not healed between battles. Right, okay. So, am I not taking on the tournament right now then? I feel like I just gotta go south. I thought I'd be getting the third gym badge, but going to the swamp. Let's go check this place out. It's looking pretty cool. Hi. The swamp is spooky. There are some cute Pokemon here. Alright, nice. Ooh, level 18 Yammer. Yeah, that's fine. Let's go powder. So we got a gold bat last episode, which is real cool. We got armored choke. So our team's looking real good. Maybe this episode we can evolve our um our Taylor and our Shinx. Yeah, Luxio and Swallow. That'd be kind of cool, but Marsh Dump, uh, we should go... Not really got the best against the Marsh Dump, I'll be honest. Let's go for Hypnosis. And then we'll go for a Confuser in case you wake up. And then, oh, you woke up. And Hypnosis again. No! And it's after Confusion. What is this Hacks Man? Wakes up right away. Gets with the Confusion right away. Stay asleep and stay confused. Alright, keep powder snowing. See, this is what I wanted. Hurt yourself. Ah. It's fine. This is not as bad as last episode. Last episode, we didn't win a tournament because we got flinched so many times in a row. And it should have been easy. An easy win, but we got second place. And then we also got flinched four times in a row by, um... What was it? I think it was a gold bet. Yeah, we almost lost, which was, um... Really annoying. <laughs> Could have been so bad. So the Pokemon I caught are so cute. How could they lose? Because they ain't strong. But I'm going to lead off with Talo for a little bit just to try and get this Swellow. Oh, we can go through this bit here. Okay. We just like get covered in swamp juice. <laughs> so Mighty Trainer. My little Nidoran got snatched by a thief. He ran right in that cave there. Don't know what to do. I'm on it. I'll stop the thief. Hey, oh. Block cave. Are you the thief? 
So what's the point in waiting in this dark cave? I don't know. Let me teach you. <laughs> yeah, why are you? Oh, whoa! The shiny Togepi looks sick! Oh man! I have a Togepi in the box, but it looks nowhere near as cool as that. i got to see what like a, a shiny Togekiss looks like. That's so cool. Oh man, I'm jealous. If I had a shiny Togepi, I would definitely use it. That looks too good. We got we got a shiny Drifloon last episode, but... It's like just a normal shiny Drifloon. It's like not a cool looking one. I kind of just don't really want to use it too much. <laughs> but... Yeah, we probably should use a shiny because the stats get increased. But at the same time, my team is I say really good already, but just get taken out here. Um, you know, my team's are, my team's pretty decent. All right, let's go air cutter. Uh, is Peck better than air cutter? I feel like it is for Murkrow. All right, uh, gonna lead off with Shinx. Want to get this Luxio, man? I feel like Luxio has got to be very soon. But being a ranger is tough. Let me show you just how tough it is. All right, please do. All right, go for it. Let's go Bulldoze. That was a critical hit. That's a little sad. Uh, Sanjet. Oh, it's so close to finishing it off. It's fine. Let's go Murkrow. Get Bam 20. I forgot we got XP share last episode as well, so we put it on to uh, Combuskin, so we'll get XP. Nice, 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 and Crocodile, I can stay in. Just keep pecking. I'm going to double check, Air Cutter does a little bit. We get Attack Boost from Metal Claw, might be nice. I'm just going to peck, it's too risky. Too risky, one more peck. Oh, let's go, Murkrow. Whew. It's a little scary. Got a great boy. I don't think we can get this guy's Nidoran back because it looks like we need strength, which we don't have. All right then. So I'll, uh, I'll get your Nidoran back another time when, um, yeah, I have strength. For now, you can just stay kidnapped. All right, can I get over there? I don't. Oh no, I can. I think. If I go like this. Go around here, and this takes us to this dude. Uh, hi. You made a terrible mistake. I have. I don't think so. Oh, uh, let's go. Machoke. And we'll go Thunder Punch. Yeah. You made a terrible mistake. I'm gonna fly and type trainer against uh, my Machoke. Thunder Punch. Uh oh, it's fine. Thunder Punch. Woo. All good, all good. Level 24. Nice. So, what do we got? XP Turbo. Nice. I'm going to save these for like later on when it gets like a bit harder to train. But for now, we should be fine. Don't have to worry about levels too much. Uh, hi. This uh, big log is blocking the way. I guess I'll have to wait until someone with true strength comes along and makes it disappear. Alright, so we definitely need strength. This is not my natural habitat, but I will take you on nonetheless. Alright. Uh, Druba, let's go into Fanta. Fanta's getting a lot of experience that can be shared. Already level 24. Well, for me, like our weakest to like our strongest, so quick. Shield on, that's fine. Just keep flame charging. Nice, and then one more flame charge. Oh, or not. Now one more flame charge. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so what else we got around here? Let's go and grab that. Grip claw, sweet. Uh, can't get that item there. Ooh, time pole. Can't get around. Uh, hi, want to battle? My goodness, I'm, I'm stranded. <laughs> and I'm going to defeat your Pokemon so they can't even rescue you. Hey, you'll definitely be stranded. Sucks for you. Oh, bubble Beam, ouch. It's fine, just go peck. Oh, you got a critical hit? That really sucks. Come on, you got a crit on me. I'm very weak. I need to really get healed up. A quick claw activate on fake out. Nice. <laughs> Not that we need it. All right, force palm. Sweet. Delete in the sand dial. And then Grimer. Gosh, you want thunder punch. Nice. One more thunder punch. Finish you off. Sweet, sweet, sweet. All right, before I find another train, I've definitely got to get healed up. I can leave whenever I want. Just want you to 
want you to care for me. Uh, yeah, I don't care for you. I'm sorry about that. All right, so what we got on the right side? So that's blocked off. Oh, scrap. Oh. And a whooper. So we can go this way. And send out some pretty decent Pokemon around here if you want to catch something for the gym. There's like a TM down there, but I don't think I can get, get it. Yeah, I need to get something to move this log first. So we've got to find a way to do the gym unless we're going to head west. Can we head west out of this town? We can. Don't you get fully healed when you enter the town? You do. Nice. So let's go this way. Carnival Park. Ah, okay. The gym leader's got to be around here then because she sounds like she's like a ringmaster. This is the Druva Carnival. It's as lively as I imagined it'd be. Uh, hi. Honk there, fella. Want to play some Voltor Flip? It will cost you one Carnival token. I have zero Carnival tokens. What do I get to Carnival tokens, though? If you want to uh, play one of the Carnival mini games, you have to get yourself some Carnival tokens. Learn that the hard way. Yeah, but where do I get the tokens from? I want to play all the games. I want to play the mini games. I uh, tried my hand at the random prize fishing game and I got this funny looking fish. I expected some rare item. This is a total scam. Jump in. Aw. Uh, who wants to give me some tokens? Surely one of these dudes do. Oh, yes. Uh, buy tokens. Don't have a token pouch. Like if you provide one for free. Nice. Ooh. Okay. Oh, it's a thousand. Okay, I'm going to spend 10,000. I know I'm trying to save some money. Actually, no, let's get five. I feel like there's not that many games, but five. Okay, so first one is this. Step right up, step right up. It's high striker time. But wait, this is a special striker. You must choose one of your Pokemon to take the swing. The heavier your Pokemon is and the higher its attack stat is, the higher the strike. Right, I'm going to go for Machoke. Sure, I can do a good strike with this. Come on, Machoke. Hey! Holy, your score is 4,089. You actually did it. Hey, you got some great balls. Nice. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Some explosion dolls. Import from the Boltia region. See, they're very useful for training. Explosion doll acts like a Pokemon inside battle and it knows only the move explosion. Pretty dank if you ask me. Could be another Pokemon with a share, but put the doll at the front and you'll get yourself a party honk. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm good. I don't really want one of them. Uh, let's go talk to this dude. Want to play some Voltor Flip? Uh, sure. I've never understood how this works. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, do I get another go? Oh, wait, no, no, because I used another token. Yeah. Don't want to waste my tokens. Right. Uh... Let's see what else we got. I've got this fishing game over here. Oh. Press. Oh, wait. Oh, I wasn't ready. I pressed the wrong button. I was on my controller. Right. Oh, hard scale. Sweet. Okay. Uh, what else we got? Any more games? Uh, I wish I could free all those uh, Pokemon from their cages so they can be put into Pokeballs where they belong. <laughs> Alright, got an air balloon, nice. Uh, oh, is that a Mega Stone? For Pidgeot, nice. That dude looks very suspicious there. Hi. So, where do we get these Pokemon from? Madam Tsukiyomi takes care of that. I recognize that name. But the balloon fellow said he'd be waiting for some important guest, so we can't ride it right now. Aw. Mommy, can we ride the balloon? No, you cannot. Hello, I'm Harry the Pilot. Usually I would give you a ride to Canyon Pass, but right now I'm waiting for an important client that has employed me to give them a sky tour of the Omoro region. Yeah, it's definitely me. I'll have a free tour, but um, my grandson works as one of the masked entertainers here. He really should find a real job. Oh, technically I'm a masked entertainer. <laughs> have I not got a real job? So Ashley's final act, the uh, fire hoops might seem cruel. It actually is. What am I even doing here? Oh, cool. Oh. Are you going to watch the uh, show? It's almost at the end. I will do it in a little bit. Greetings, I'm a traveling move tutor. I can teach one of your Pokemon a Sucker Punch. Ooh, I do have a heart scale. But no one can learn Sucker Punch. Sad. Uh, the circus and the carnival are run by the Tsukuyomi family. Ashi Tsukuyomi in particular. Okay. 
So in the in my younger days, I was a dancer in a traveling circus. My, my, you should have seen me. Okay, did I talk to these two? Listen, Timmy, that thing uh, can't even move on its own. Gonna get you a Snorlax and win the grand prize. But mom, I believe in Mr. Carps. I know he can win the grand striker prize. No, he cannot. Uh, let's see. So we've got a few more tokens. I'm gonna go for the, the fishing game, just to use our tokens up. Well, one more token, let's go. Ah! No! I thought it stops instantly. Ah, oh, man. It's fine. All right, let's go. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, for our final act, Bailiff will jump through the narrow hoop. Seems impossible given it's a Bailiff, right? I'm here to show you that it is very possible. Oh, very. It's not only possible, it's easy. Easy, my dear audience. It's so easy, we're gonna have to add a little twist. <gasps> oh my, what a twist. Now, we all know grass type Pokemon are weak to fire, aren't they? If she doesn't execute this perfectly, they'll end up badly. Oh no. Hold your breath, folks. There's about to be smoke in here. Let's go, Pokemon. Are you kidding me? I said let's go. Make the jump. I don't care if you succeed. It'll be a show either way. Hey! I mean, I don't like it, but at the same time, at least, it, at least it's fine. But wow. Did you see that, folks? What accuracy. Not a single leaf burnt. And that concludes our program for today. Thank you for coming, everyone. Hope you had a blast. It's all right. Uh, yo. Well, someone go clean this mess afterwards, you know? And right now, that someone is me. <laughs> uh, hi. Hmm? The gym captain? She's probably in the backstage, resting. I wouldn't go bother if I were you, though. Oh, I forgot. Someone said in after this gym. Oh, no, was it the second gym? Oh, no. I remember in the second gym. I forgot someone told me, um, we can get an egg for a Pokemon, but it might be in the second gym. I feel like this might be the last show here in Dew River. Actually, she's not been feeling it lately. Okay. So after we do this, I might quickly run back to the second gym just to double check. It's not anything rare, but I mean, a free Pokemon's a free Pokemon. This job sucks. Everything stinks in here. I should switch to being a Pokemon trainer. That's easy. Not that easy. Uh, hi. So a Pokemon trainer? You better not be doing anything funny or we'll lock you up in one of those cages. Oh, Bayleaf. Wish I can free you, my dude. Something's blocking the way, so we're not going that way. Going down here. Hey kid, I have nothing to do, let's battle. Yeah, sure, let's do it. Let's go, you got a seal, okay. Uh, go with head smash. Oh, so weak. It's fine, we'll go with sand jet, finish you off. Nice, nice, nice. Mr. Mime. We'll go Talo. Might get a swallow, hopefully very soon. Encore, yeah, sure, encore me. I'm down for spam and spark. Absolutely. You know, I respect Ashy, but her methods are sometimes too extreme. Perhaps her upbringing is to be blamed. Never mind. You want to battle? Yes, you do. Uh, did you get lost? Get out of here. Make me. What are you going to do, huh? You going to send your little smooch him out? Not smooch him, uh, Mr. M Mime Jr. <laughs> what a bulldoze it. I bulldoze everything. Quick attack. Uh, yeah, I'm going to growl. And then Mr. Mime. He's going to Murkrox his part fairy. Go for a nice uh, middle claw. Nice. And then one more Metal Claw. Ooh, so close, so close. Hey, level 23 and Spikes. Spikes could be good. Let's get rid of Oh no, I wanted to get rid of Air Color because I think Peck's like, physical moves are better than special for Murkrow. Uh, hi. You sure this is the way you want to go? How about you go back, huh? How about you go back? I'm fine, man. I'm, I'm good where I'm going. And, oh, critical hit. Okay. And then we just go Sand Jet. Nice. And Mr. Mime will go into Murkrow again. Just start spamming that Metal Claw. Maybe we can take this out. Ooh, just about. Hey, look at the attack boost. They can probably stay in. Kadabra. Uh, no. It's, mm, too risky. I'll get the experience, though. Oh, that actually does a lot to Talo. Oh, we live on 1 HP, Talo, you absolute legend. Can't believe that. Oh, uh, hi. Who are you and why are you bothering us? Leave. Omei, uh, Wade, Nani, Zenzen, Wakar, Wakarimasen? 
I have no idea what that means. Someone could let me know, that'd be great. I can hear someone coming. Oh, but hide. Yes, Ashy. I'll tell them not to bother you. Okay. Uh, can we go in? Oh, she's in the bath. Ah, <sighs> finally alone. Uh, hello. What the hell? Uh, whoa. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> now I'm here for the badge. I want to give a shuckle about your stupid badge. Could you see him in a bathtub? Lana, Leo. You called, boss? Do I have to spell it out to you too? So dense. That creeper see me naked. Get rid of him now. Oh, you come with us, kiddo. <laughs> oh, uh, they really roughed me up. How long have I been knocked out? Where? I'm in a cage? My Pokemon have been taken. I need to get out of here somehow. There's some keys over on that box. How do I get to them? Uh... Hey, Bailey, want to help me out? Is that poor Bailey from the show? Should I try calling to it? Yes. Uh, Bailey, please, you got to help me. Doesn't seem to trust me. If only I had some hay. Oh, some hay. Take some hay. Give it to you. Hey, Bailey, let's see if you're like this. I won't hurt you. You can trust me. Bailey, we have to get out of here. I like to free both of us, but I'm going to need those keys. If you could grab them for me, we could escape together. Aw. Do we get a free Bailey for doing this mission? That'd be kind of cool, but yeah. That's it. Use Vine Whip to get them. Hey. Wow, you did it. Now I can lock the doors. All right. So you're free now. Let's sneak out of this place. All right, so we got a bay leaf. Oh, I went on the head. Never mind. Uh, from my Pokemon though. Oh, this looks not great. Lights. Uh oh, the scum has finally appeared. Uh oh. So where are my Pokemon? Oh, shut your mouth. You dare break into my abode? Well, I'm bathing, and then proceed to steal my bay leaf. Huh? This bay leaf uh, was suffering. Hmm. If you're so righteous, why don't you save all suffering Pokemon? I intend to. Yeah, oh, what a naive answer. But they might just be. Mother, you are wrong. No, it's too early to conclude that. Prove to me that you stand behind those words. That you're ready to suffer instead of the suffering Pokemon. Prove to me by taking Bayleaf's, Bayleaf's place. Jump through the hoop. Um, if you catch on fire, we have water Pokemon ready. Don't worry. You're insane. You really expect me to do this? There's no backing down now, kid. All right, here we go. Hey! Oh my god, I actually made it! <laughs> you really jumped for her. <laughs> what a manky. Let's go, Tommy. Hey. So here, here are your Pokemon back. Sorry for taking them. Ashley wanted to see what you would do. The truth is, after Lana knocked you out, we did a background check on you. You fought the Berserk Pokemon at the lake, and you helped many people along the way. After we told Ashley about you, she was curious, so she came up with this little test. Well, I think you passed. Probably. I'm sure she'll at least uh, be willing to hear you out about the badge you need. Oh, the Bayleaf just like walked with him. Is Bayleaf like... Like, in on it as well? But I guess I go back and I talk to him again, eh, Bayleaf? Oh, yeah. Sweet, okay. Maybe that was the free Pokemon? If Volt's the Ashes in her tent, she won't be undressed this time around, so don't worry. I think Ashy sees something in you, after you prove you're willing to uh, take on the suffering of others. I saw a certain spark in her eyes. Well, whatever she decides to do from here on out, we'll follow her. Okay. Ashi-chan wosuki desu ka? Kawaii jana ka? Atashi ga so omotsu? I don't know what that says. Uh, hi. Alright, please forgive her for torturing you. Our mother left us in charge of the circus in the city's uh, battle grid arena. All while being very hot on her, but recently she stopped bothering us. What did she say? Wasted... Uh... Dean... Any? What does that even mean? I'm sorry, I talk too much. Uh, yo. So it's you. I had a feeling you would come, uh, come asking me things again. Fine, take a seat. Alright. So I heard you have, uh, two badges at the moment, and I assume you need the third one. What a pointless endeavour. Proving your worth through collecting these silly objects. This is a fabricated reality. What do you really wish to gain from that? Uh, power. Power, I see. To crave power is perhaps one of Mother's gifts. But it's a foolish reason. Well, whatever. I'll allow you to battle me at the arena. I saw your determination back there. 
Now I've got I've yet to see your strength. The one who defeated the Berserk Pokemon will surely be a worthy opponent of mine. I'll still crush you, don't worry. Well, if that's all, be gone now. I'll come to the tournament arena once I'm finished here. Oh, and also I expect you to beat everyone in the tournament before you dare challenge me, okay? Right, okay. So, let's uh, go back. Before I enter the tournament, let me double check. Because um, I'm pretty sure someone said the second or third gym. If it's the second gym, we'll run back and get the Pokemon. If it's the third gym, then we'll obviously do it after. But uh, give me a second. Yeah, so it says at the uh, back of the second gym, but you need a free party slot. So let me just quickly put something in. So I can just uh, go and grab it real quick. Right, I won't be long. I'll see you guys at the second gym. All right, we're at the second gym. I took no time at all to run back. So if we go back here, back here. Wait. Oh, I love that music that plays. That's cool. So we've got an egg. Uh, don't know what it's going to be, but uh, ooh, you can name an egg. Let's just run or try a hatch it by the time we get back. So I'll see you guys back uh, where we were, and then I'll see if I have this egg's anywhere near hatching. If not, then we'll just go do the third gym, and we'll hatch the next episode. Okay, so the egg doesn't seem close to hatching. That's fine. Let's uh, go and get it out. Well, get gob out of the box. Uh, put you in, we'll hatch you later on. What else the bay leaf? 25. It's got 2 GP though. That's honestly not too bad. I want to check this as well. Alright, uh, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Anyway, let's go take on the tournament and then if we win it, we can go take on the third gym. Alright, let's do this. Hello. Uh, there are, we've got the free free 30. Oh, are we? We're a little bit under level, but we might be fine. Probably. Can I take the uh, lucky egg off you, put it onto you. And let's uh, give this a go. Go pay 800 for it, oof. Uh, yeah, let's go with these three. This might be alright. All oh, the the battle grid arena looks really nice. All right, let's go bulldoze. Ooh, that's not great. Okay, uh, we better switch into Talo. A lot of damage got the paralysis though, that's good. Wing attack, finish it off. Nice. Fire Fang. Ooh. Ooh, that's not bad. A bit of fire coverage right now. Uh bag on. Let's go with choke. Get some nice little fake out. Nice. And then we'll go force palm. That's great. And then Murkrow. Back in a Talo, go for that spark. Got the paralysis, nice. Live, 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 live. Ah, oh, unlucky. Come on, Shinx, finish it off. Oh, got the flinch, you didn't finish it off, but that flinch really saved us. That was so close. Alright, next up. We do definitely get fully healed, yeah, that's good. Ooh, okay. All those, didn't flinch me, that's good. Let me outspeed you now. Nice! My Omoran Shinx is so much better than your normal Luxio. Uh, Mokro will go Taylor. And keep going for that Spark. Hey, Paralysis, nice. And another Spark. So oh, you just let me go and see the HP. So teeny tiny. Right, oh, not Lanoon. Remember what happened last time we battled Lanoon? Like the four flinches? No, it was three flinches. Or two flinches. I took out my, my matchup at the time. But now, we should be fine. Yeah, no flinches this time. No flinch, no win. Yeah. All right, next dude. Marsh Dump. Ooh, okay. Uh, this is honestly the worst Pokemon for us to battle. I'm going for Bide. That's fine. I'm going to bulk up. 
Bulk up. And then force palm. Yeah, let's go. Thunder wave, we don't need thunder wave. Wait, 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 smelling salts? Uh... Okay, now I wish I kind of had it, but... Oh, that's fine, it's fine. All we need is bulk up and we can just force palm everything. <laughs> Look how strong we are. Oh. You know, it's because of the intimidate, but we're still fine. Yeah. Easy. That it? Tournament is over. Oh, hmm. To defeat all the weaklings in the tournament. I did promise you a fight, so you're gonna get one. Faulty, let's set the stage ablaze. Release your first Pokemon. Alright, I hope we can do this. Mighty Enna, that's not too great, but we can switch into Machoke. Gonna go bulk up, please go for Sucker Punch. Nice! And bulk up. Oh, we're gonna sweep you with Machoke! Yeah, boy, one more bulk up and then we start going in. There's no way. There's no way you kill me now. I'm gonna destroy your whole team. Well, oh, that's fine. Force Palm! Oh, Bulk Up and Macho, too good. Hound Hour? Oh, is that it? That can't be it. That was so easy! Macho, you absolute monster, and Shinx is gonna evolve as well. Nice. Woo! Let's go, BD! Oh, that looks so good. That looks very good. Wow, I haven't had a battle such as this one in a while. I can't believe I even thought it was fun. You thought that was fun? I thought it was easy, but you didn't hear that. Anyways, for the boring rules and regulations, I have to give you this. The Ember Badge, woo! Nice, nice, nice. With that badge, the soft level cap for your Pokemon will now be 40. Also, we need to have this TM. Your fire Pokemon will like it. Got Flame Charge. Nice, 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 and of course, your Torment Award. 6,000, nice. You'll probably be heading straight for the next gym now, huh? Oh, never mind. This is goodbye. Oh, uh, hi. Faulty, Faulty, wait a minute, please. Congratulations on your blazing victory here. How do you feel? Uh... Rad. Thank you, Faulty. There you have it, dear viewers. The words of a winner. Stay tuned, because in a few moments, the second round will begin. Bring into your screens the more fiery challenges. Alright, sweet. So that's three badges down. Oh. Hello? Uh, Fultzy, Professor Almond here. Where are you now? Outside Duriva Arena? Ara, Ara, I'm in Duriva too. Come visit me. There's something I'd like you to meet. Oh, uh, I'll be waiting for you in the research lab in the west part of the city. So, got your starters and your first three badges, huh? Huh. Then I may have something for you. Have you heard about these things called cards? Every Pokemon in the world has a 1% chance to drop on its own card. If you defeat it, it'll catch it. Equipping a card to the Pokemon will give its stats massive boosts, so it's well worth it. Now how about it? For a small fee of 15,000, I will give your starter Pokemon a card. It's... Mmm... I... Mm, I want... Yeah, I think it's worth it. Just like the starter Pokemon as well, that's fine, we'll do this. So how do you equip the card? Oh, it's got the card on it already. Uh, so if I wanted to unequip a card, how do I do that? just want to check how the card system works. Uh, where are the cards? Wait, what? I don't know how that works. Well, the card's on it. Unless... Ah, take card. And then, is the card now in here? Uh, no? In bag? Oh, like that. And equip it. Sweet, okay. Right. Uh, does... Question now, does... I'm assuming the card will evolve with me, right? So I have a Blazer can have a Combuscan card, will it still work? Will it become a com Will it become a Blazer King card? I'm not sure how that works. Oh, I should have checked. 
All right, let's go to the uh, the west and we'll go check out. Is it in here we need to go? Oh, Volzi. So this train is with me, officer. Professor, I came here when I heard they caught a strange Pokemon at the lake. I was surprised. However, to find out you and Moira were the ones that fought it? Volzi, may I see your Pokedex for a minute? Hmm, the Pokedex has no data on this Pokemon. At least it's a picture. Oh my, that is a terrifying creature. I have to show this to Professor Stein. Right, there's another reason I called you here. Professor Stein is a friend of mine who works in this research lab. He has a uh, handy gadget that will help you along your journey. Well, let's go meet him. Just follow me. Sounds good. Can I go explore the place first? Ooh. Uh, if you have the power glove, okay. Oh, that takes us there. Okay, so I guess we just go down like this. Full heal. Love the music here. This is so cool. Uh, yes, it's quite jarring, isn't it? What do you make of it? Bobsy, hey. Is this the young trainer you've been talking about, Almond? Indeed they are. Voltsy, it's good to see you at the Du River Lab. Professor Stan and I go way back. We went to the same university, actually. Ah yes, the university days. I don't remember half of it. <laughs> Afterwards, we worked together on several projects, studying Pokemon and Pokemon-related phenomenon. Phenomenon, yes, indeed. Quite certainly. That's a very oblique way of putting it. I would not have expected anything less from a respectable persona such as yourself, Professor Almond. <laughs> In any case, I was just uh, showing Professor Stein the Berserk Pokemon, as they call it here. Yes, I find it quite fascinating. The rangers brought it here in a cage, covered with black sheets. I was prepared to see uh, some magic trick, but all they did was uh, load it into the elevator and send it off to the deep underground elite secret lab chambers that I've uh, never seen or heard about. But now that I've uh, seen its picture, I conclude one thing. Whoever created that thing, they sure don't know anything about aesthetics. Wait, created it? Oh yeah, baby, it's just my theory though. But there's one thing we scientists like to do with theories, that's proving them right or wrong. Professor uh, Milva, Malva, and I picked up peculiar leftover energy readings from this thing. We're working on a device that could possibly detect the energy from far away. So if my theory is correct, and this Pokemon is manufactured, then I also suspect that we might see another one before too long. Hence the device. If another Berserk Pokemon appears, I want, it, want to track it down, and examine it up close. But don't tell anyone. No one knows. No one approved. I get a feeling from our big bossy heads our research that we're not supposed to poke, you know? But I can't help it. It's like an itch. I just gotta scratch it, man. Even if it means I'm losing a few fingers. Now, wasn't there something else I was supposed to say? Give? Ah, yes. Could you show us the uh, power glove, Professor? Right, absolutely. Without a shred of doubt. On the double, I shall present to you the retro modern piece of equipment that will shatter all obstacles in your way. Oh, okay. This is a precious device. Not entirely innocuous, though you may think otherwise. We got the power glove! More importantly, Volzi, with this power glove you'll be able to move heavy objects with ease. You might have noticed a big tree log block in the path in the Cheyenne Swamp. I did. Use this power glove now to move it. Yeah, sure, I noticed it. Thanks, Professor. By the way, Volzi, I've confirmed that Agent Janin that you met in Shimonk is trustworthy. He said he couldn't make it to Do River, but he'll contact you sometime later. About your father's letter. And some of some some sort of hidden message? Did you say a hidden message? I have a PhD in hidden messages. Maybe I can help you. Now, now, Professor Stein, I'm afraid this is classified information. Is that so? Is that so? Oh. Volzi, there's another interesting thing you might look up while you're here. Professor Malvard specializes in Pokemon DNA surgery. She can change your Pokemon's nature for a small fee. Aside from that, your next destination should be Emperor Town, if I'm not mistaken. So give me a call anytime if you need anything. Take care, Volzi. Alright, so we've got the power glove so we can uh, start doing stuff, but GP Fusion? Oh, okay. No, 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 no. About GP. So generation power. We know about GP. But um, the fusion sounds kind of cool. But again, once late, later on in the game when we get a lot of money, we can maybe start doing stuff. Uh, hi. You can change your Pokemon's IVs, EVs, and even natures. Science! Science, baby. So this book is making me moist. <laughs> as, as in sweaty. Submit in heat. <laughs> Welcome to new... Uh, uh, Sequencing uh, algorithm, it should bring us closer to the truth. Uh, hello there, child. Would you like me to perform surgery on one of your Pokemon to change its nature? No, I'm good. So what spectral energy reading device in my hand? That's ludicrous. I don't know what you're yapping about. Sure. 
Feather Stein is the inventor of the Stein wavelets that can heal your Pokemon wirelessly. It's pretty cool, man. So we can move this now. What have we got in here? Ooh. Hyper Potion. Sweet. Okie dokie. So now... Uh... Oh, uh, hi. I thought I saw you go in here. I just quit both my jobs. Faulty, I don't care about the circus or the arena anymore. Never really cared that much about them anyways. I'm taking my weakling brother with me too. I know he wouldn't survive on, this, uh, on his own out, out here. Mother tested us to see if we were strong enough. And then she sort of forgot about us. It makes me livid. It makes me want to whip things into submission. But you know what? Screw that. That woman. I'll make sure she... Faulty, give me your number. Okay. So since we'll both be traveling the region, I'm sure our paths will cross again. Goodbye, Voltsy. Get stronger. Next time we battle, I'll expect you to be... Never mind. Okay. Oh, there's Moira. But I think it's a very great place to end this pod off. Uh, next episode, we'll go down, battle Moira, go to the swamp, uh, go rescue that guy's Nidoran, and then make our way to the next town. All right. So for you guys watching, I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.